Good morning. Hello, everyone. Thank you for coming. And those of you who do not like the chat before the video, you are welcome to fast forward just a little bit or watch this video in fast forward. Did you know you can do that on YouTube? You can click the little gear and watch in, I think, 0.25 faster, 0.5 faster, 0.75 faster. Maybe not so much. I know you can do two times faster or one and a half faster and 0.5 or one times. All right, thank you for coming, everybody. You guys are amazing. We have a lot of fun. Before the video, we chat for about a half an hour. And um, we do this every Saturday morning, 11 a.m., same, st I just wanted to say, same bat station, same bat time. Do you guys remember that? Am I showing my age? I think that was from the 70s and watching Batman. Am I alone here? <laughs> Um, so we had so much fun last week doing Pinterest inspired things. And I thought, you know, I didn't know how that would go. And I showed so many things. I showed how to weld and contour. And there were so many things I showed differently on how to use different designs. So I thought we could do that again because I wanted to do more last week. Um, Oh, you're all looking at the puppies. Yes. Oh, and her flower shows, they got groomed. I have somebody come here to groom them so I can continue to work and not have to stop working and take them somewhere. And she has a flower around her neck and she has a bow in her hair. And it took me a whole day to find the flower around her neck. I didn't know it was there because it was underneath. Even petting her and everything. Like, didn't see it. They're always hiding something. Um... Good, I'm not the only Batman that watched that in the early 70s. Well, it couldn't have been early 70s or I wouldn't remember it. It had to be mid-70s. Um, oh, I wanted to do, first, I wanna tell you about the Cricut sales. I do have some links in the description. I only get commission when you use my links. Uh, but they're having a huge sale at Cricut. Uh, it's buy one, get one free on so many things. So it's like 50% off. And then when you use my code Melody Lane, you get another 10% off. If you have access, you get another 10% off. Remember, if you have access, this is the month to get it if you don't have it. But if you have it, you get 10% off absolutely everything you purchase except for access. Access is the only thing where you don't get a discount on anything. But if you have access, you it's on absolutely everything. So the machines and everything. So when you see these sales, these Black Friday sales, Cricut, on the Cricut website, it's the same sale. You're not gonna find it cheaper than the Cricut website because you're gonna get that 10% off if you have access. My code does not work on machines but it does on the cuddle bug and that's on sale for only $59. All right, I wanted to, uh, let's go over here. I wanted to give a shout out because I have been doing the sponsorship now for six months, the YouTube sponsorship. So you'll see some people that have a little badge by their name or their name is green. Some of my moderators, their names are blue, but they also have a badge. So, um, they support my channel and they get all my files and things. Yes, you even get a discount on the maker. And the maker's on sale for $349, so you get 10% off that. Um, Mystery Box should be back on Monday. They, they're not really sold out. They just turned it off because they were having problems with codes and with some things. So they're taking the time to fix it. So it works properly and it will be back. They're shooting for Monday, but we're not positive. It's depending on what gets fixed. Um, and I wanted to, let's go to design space button. I wanted to give a shout out to the people who have been supporting me for six months. So I will do this every week as I get new people uh, supporting me. We have House of Glass Deco. Kathy Pace, Glenda, Glenda's usually here, Sandy, Heather, Shelly, Ronald, 
And then look, we have some more that I think are just coming next week. They will be at six months, even though it says five months, it doesn't say the weeks. Um, so I know these will be uh, coming soon. So at six months, let me show you the badges. So if you join my YouTube channel, at, when you're new, you just get the cricket head, and then one month you grow in tennis, two months you grow the body, and six months you grow the arms, and then one year you're full body, two years you are purple. So I think it's fun to see. Um, I don't see any arms here yet. If Glenda shows up, she she has arms. Hi, Lynn. Um, okay, are you guys ready to start design space class? Let's go here. Okay, here's design space. I have Pinterest open. Um, oh, I was just here a few minutes ago and I saw something that was cute. I just went to Pinterest. I didn't search anything. And I had an idea I was going to start with and I was going to let you guys, um... Tell me what to search. There is not a cricket pin that whites writes white on black. Yes, Karen, you are armless. Okay. The thing I was looking for um, had a reindeer in it. So I'm going to search reindeer. Did I spell that right? Yeah, I guess so. Oh, I wish I could find that one I had. And just changed it on me, and I didn't want them to. Um, yeah, for YouTube sponsors, they get the emojis and the badges, the special emojis and the badges, and um, they also get my Cricut Design Space files. Okay, I think the one I was looking for was an embroidery one. So I don't know. That's cute. Reindeer kisses and snowflake wishes. That's cute. Merry Christmas. Oh, your badge does have arms, Jamie. It is super hard to see the arms. They're so small, but they that's just how YouTube does them. To get the badges, you have to click the join button under the video. It's $4.99 a month. There's Ronald. You're awesome, Ronald. Thank you so much. Ronald has arms. <laughs> the word of the day is synergy. We are better together. Yes, we are. Oh my gosh, look at that. It's a reindeer-like skull.
Yeah, maybe I can do something with the arms and change that badge so you can see the arms better. I don't know if I can change the color of them. I should have taken a picture of that one I saw. This is cute. Do you guys want to make this in design space? This one in the middle? I think we can make that. Oh, and that's cute too. That one's cute. Okay, let's just, there's a few different ones with just the reindeer ears and face, I mean, like that. Um, so let's just go ahead and go into design space. There's the Cricut website. I Okay, look at this. Look how cute this is. They made a banner out of fabric, put ribbon through the top, and ironed on these words. And for the word sale, they put a reindeer in the center. This would be so cute if you had a store or something and you had a Christmas tree in the store and you could put this on it or just put this banner anywhere. That's just so cute. So like if you want to make this banner at home, you could totally make this banner at home. I wouldn't put sale on it at home. Maybe joy or peace or Merry Christmas or whatever you want, but that's so cute. Okay. Um, okay, so we are going to go to images. First, we're gonna get the eyes. So many eyes. Let me know when you see some eyes. Oh, we could look up lashes, because isn't it just lashes? So cute. Oh, I like these. That's a llama face, but we could just use the eyes too. <laughs> these have little eyes on them. Okay, um, where'd they go? I'm gonna bring that in, but we're gonna go back. I'm gonna go lashes. Okay, I'm gonna click on cartridges. There's a whole new cartridge about eyes. This one, in the blink of an eye. We can even put glasses on our reindeer. So what do you... So if you just search eye instead of eyes, you would find these. Um... I think I like these the best. And if we don't want to use this, although we could, we can just contour. So for those of you that don't know how to contour, go down to the bottom right for this corner, hit the word that says contour. You have this, click the image you don't want to keep and then click off of it. And now we just have the eyes. Let's look at our Pinterest stuff again. Um, we need antlers and some holly and ears. What are we gonna search for ears? 
see if they just have ears. Oops, I gotta click on the images. <laughs> Not those ears. I don't think they have, oh, we can make an elf. Anything with just like reindeer ears. <gasps> ooh, I like those ears. <laughs> but we're making a reindeer. Um, let's go to reindeer. Watch, they already have the image we're trying to make, probably. Okay. I'm going to click on this for antlers. We can make the ears out of shapes. Um, you can still design the image and not cut it out and then save it. And then when you do get access, you can cut it out. Or if it's a, something you're going to use a lot, if you purchase just the image, you don't have to have access. You can purchase the image and you have it for your life. It never goes away. You can cut it out as many times as you like. I might try those ears hello kitty reindeer i don't like those ears but i like those antlers um she says let's reindeer head hmm I don't know. Let's pull this down. There's like a realistic looking reindeer head. Just put a red nose on them. Okay, we got animal heads now. All right, let's see what we got. Oh, did I not click add them? Did I have some? Oh, I lost them. I found some when I was just on reindeer. Hi, Mamie. Okay, we're looking for reindeer antlers and ears. Oh yeah, I was gonna work with with that with something. And where's some antlers? That are cute but not too cute. That, <laughs> what is that? Every day is a holiday. Rudolph has a cape. So cute. Here's some. There's some. I think that's like the one I already have. Kind of like those. Oh yeah, there's a whole new reindeer cartridge. Oh, that one's Christmas icons. Every day is a holiday. 
Oh yeah, I liked his. So now it shows all these at the bottom that I am choosing. And if I decide I don't want one, I can just click it off, click the X. Okay, I think we're good for now. Um, now let's choose, I'm gonna zoom out. We're gonna choose the antlers and I'm gonna let you guys choose. Ronald, Ronald just purchased treats for the reindeer. He is amazing. Okay, this one and this one are the same except for this has a tag. We're not using that tag. Thank you, Ronald. <laughs> yeah, maybe he says I'm in the famous uh, image rabbit hole where you go in and you find more images and more images. And oh, look at this, how cute it is. Okay, right now we're looking at antlers. Which antlers do you like best? So we're going to go one, two, three four, five. Which antlers do you like best for our, let me click over to Pinterest. We're going to kind of make something like this, make like a reindeer head. Could put it on an ornament or a shirt or a card or anything. Something like those is what we're making. We're not copying, copying exactly. So we have one, two, three, four, five. Okay, we're getting three fours, a three, five, one, five, four. Looks like four is the winner. One, two, three, four. Okay. And this one I want to use for ears, I think. Okay, wait a minute. Let's, okay, this one is loser. Um, so we're doing these. We're not using those ears. Uh, which ears do you like? These ears, these ears, these ears, or do you want me to try to just create our own ears? So we got one, two, or uh, make them. Oh, there's a unicorn file that I can use the ears from. All right. Let's go back to images. Let's search unicorn. I think you're so right. Or a horse. I mean, they have the ears. Uh, let's see if there's better ears. Oh, yeah. We could use we could use the eyes from this too. Oh, or giraffes maybe says that would look good. Okay, let's bring this one in. Uh, now you're making me spell live on video. Oh, yeah, I like the, oh, May May, you are so right. Okay, let's just go for those. Okay. All right, these do not seem so good now compared to these. All right, we're getting rid of these, right? We're using these antlers. So let's move this up. These are so much better. Or the giraffe. So for the ears, do you like unicorn or giraffe? So one or two. Good morning, Michael. My promo code is Melody Lane as one word, but I only get commission when you go through my link. 
So there's links in the description. Okay, it looks like the giraffe may be winning. Okay, I, I think it's the giraffe. I kind of like those too. Okay, and hey, these would be too easy, right? Okay, let's, wow, look at the layers of this giraffe. This would be one cool giraffe made out of um, paper. Okay, let's see. Where, let's, we're hiding layers over here. I'm clicking the eye on the, okay, wait, I like that one. That one doesn't show. That one, don't need that one. Okay, let's ungroup. Okay, this part, goes right there on that. And then this is the back. You don't see it. I don't know. You don't see it. It's just the background. So we don't really need that. So now we need to cut this out. We need to slice this away. So we're going to grab a circle. To unlock it, kind of make it more of a shape of the head. Doesn't have to be perfect. Oh, well, okay. Let me zoom in so you guys can see, and I can see better. Okay, this looks good, but I can see part of the head right here. We want to make sure we cut that off. Okay, so now we're going to select the circle and the giraffe. I'm selecting both by hitting the, actually I hit the command, let me see. The shift, yeah, you can hit shift key and we're going to slice. If your slice is not lit up, then there's a reason and you can find that reason in the layers panel. As you can see, I only have two layers connected. If another image was connected to that, attached or grouped, it would not work. So we're gonna slice. Now, as you can see, it didn't slice it all away. Well, I know how to fix that really easy. So now you could go and put a rectangle over this and slice this out, and or you can just hit the contour button. I'm gonna click down here, it says hide all contours. Because this is a giraffe and it has other pieces in here, we're gonna hit hide all. So what that does is it saves the biggest one um, to be cut, but we just want the ears. So we're gonna click the ears now. Now we're gonna click this biggest image off. And you can tell it's off because it's a lighter color and the ears are the only ones lit up. So if you scroll down, all the other ones are grayed out. So we're gonna go up here and now we just have the ears. And now we have these ears. And if you hear snoring, that is my dogs, not me or anybody else. So we're gonna group these together. These are separate pieces we're gonna group. So now we have the ears. Okay, let's zoom back out a little. Okay, so we are done with this giraffe, done with all these. I'm just gonna scroll over it so it gets rid of all of that. It's all gone. Okay, now we have these. Do we want this on there or do we wanna cut that off? Oh, we need some holly. Let's go grab some holly before we do any slicing because we might it might be okay with that. Okay, let's move these eyes. Let's kind of place these in place. Um, yes, Maymay. That is fine. We already talked about it a little bit at the beginning. Okay, so 
I might want to separate these two ears, but right now let's grab some holly. Holly, holly. I do have links below in the description about the Cricut sale. Um, what am I searching? Holly. Hmm. Here's some. Can you hear my dogs drinking? Uh, let's bring this in just to play. That was Carly drinking. Maybe that. I like this. I can show you how to make this different colors. Okay, let's, oh, look at that. So many options. <laughs> All right, there's, we're only halfway through, but let's go ahead and insert. Okay, everyone's saying slice it off. Yes, yeah, my sister, Holly. <laughs> Uh, oh. let me look at Pinterest again. So you're all saying slice it off. So, all right, let's, let's take the antlers and we're going to slice it off because you want me to. Um, if you were going to do this out of paper, I would leave it on there and add just add some things so you can glue them on there but uh for the sake of this let's go ahead and slice it off because you're most likely going to do it out of vinyl and i can show you how to do something okay so we can just drag the box around the two and select the two we have two selected and the slice is lit up there we go we are done with that, done with that, done with that. And we got the antlers. If we wanted to move the antlers, we can totally do that. Let's, let me just go show you how to do it. Okay, I duplicated it. The duplicate button is at the top of the layers panel right here. I duplicated it. I'm gonna, I have this one selected. I'm gonna go down to the contour button, bottom right. We're gonna click one, we're gonna click off of it. We only have one now. So now we're gonna to go to the other set of two antlers and we're gonna hit contour and we're gonna get rid of the opposite one. So now we have two separate ones in case we wanna move them together or further apart, whatever you wanna do. And if you wanna size them or move them together, you can group them. So now we have them grouped, and if I want to move them separately, I can ungroup them. Okay. Now we have to... I don't think this one's going to work, you think? Uh, no. I like these better. Um, I'm thinking I like this one the best. Uh, let me show you how to color these. This is only one image. You cannot ungroup it. You cannot detach it or anything like that. You can duplicate it. So now we have two. Now we can contour, click on all of these. I guess those were one image. Now we're gonna contour and we're gonna get rid of the berries. Now you can't just get rid of the outer berries or you're gonna have this little hole. So you have to click the holes also. Okay, so now we're gonna change the color of these to green. And we're gonna change the color of these to red. 
And now we got those different colors. And we can group them. Okay, let's work on the ears, the eyes. Oh, we, yeah, we need a nose and we're making Rudolph. You can make whatever reindeer you would like to make, I'm making Rudolph. So we're gonna add a shape and give him a red nose. Oh, and I want his nose to look like it's glowing. I'm just gonna duplicate this twice. So we're gonna make a little, um, I'm gonna slice these. You can see there's just a little bit. Let's change the color so you can see this. Can you see the little bit of red behind it? I'm gonna select those, slice. Okay, so now I have this little bit. I don't want it that big. Um, I'm gonna slice that off. I have that little bit. Let's see if this will, might be too small, but we can make it bigger. Um, there. Um, no, it's too fat. Maybe something like that. So it looks like the nose is glowing. Okay, get rid of that. All right, um, let's go back to Pinterest and kind of see. We could, do you guys want to do cheeks? We can do cheeks if you want to. That's just, I'll just use circles. I kind of, we gotta uh, bring this to the front. Hmm. I don't know. How do you guys want this? They have it this way. Maybe like this one. I think I like this one. Sometimes you just have to play. <laughs> Joan says you only need them if they're dancing cheek to cheek. No cheeks, okay. Oh yeah, use glitter iron on for the nose. Okay, do you like this reindeer as it is? Does that need to be a little bigger? Oh, maybe a little smaller. Does it need any changes? This one doesn't match perfectly. Um, the color of this probably needs to be more brown. Do you want this holly maybe? Is that what someone's saying? Uh, I'll arrange that to back so I can grab the holly. No holly, somebody says. Whoops.
frames to the front. Well, you can choose whatever holly you want to use. I'm just going to hide these. I thought about doing something with this too. Duplicate. You don't have to make it just like the inspiration picture. You can totally change it. Something like that would be cute too. I kind of send these to the back. Keep grabbing them. Oh, let's do a little. Could even do that. Ronald! Ice cream for the reindeer, Ronald. You are amazing. Okay, I'm going to group this little white with the nose. So when we move it, it all moves together. And we can make it smaller or whatever you want to do. I kind of like that. You guys like it? Oh, you guys, I forgot to tell you. Let me tell you this. There's Kobe turning around in bed. Um, I'm going to have the 12 days of Christmas. So for those of you who support my channel, either from Patreon or YouTube sponsors, and it can, Patreon, it starts at $2 a month, or YouTube sponsors, or Facebook fan page. Now, Facebook has a thing, too, where uh, you can get the files and get a badge and things like that. So any of those, I'm going to have a 12 days of Christmas where the first 12, where the first 12 days of Christmas, you're going to get at least a new file. Um, I've been working on some Christmas files and I have some. I'm like, I'm going to do 12 days of Christmas and give them out the first 12 days of December, you're going to get a file and some of them may come with a video so everybody can watch the video. So uh, be watching for my videos. I don't know. They're probably not going to be going to big, long planned videos because that takes too much time to do that every day or I might not have a video every day, but I will share a file for sure. Or they may just be um, simple, short videos just to show you how to how I make the file. It could be a card or an ornament or an iron-on or vinyl or, um, you know, all kinds of different things. Um, <gasps> lights on the antlers. You're right. Let, let's go grab some lights. Um, so I just wanted to tell you to look out for that for the 12 days of Christmas. All right, let's go back. Let's add some lights. Um, image. Now, I know they have lots of Christmas lights, but I don't know if, ooh, we're not going to find any with that. Oh my gosh. Oh, we found the, okay. You guys, I've never learned how to type properly. I type with one hand. Um... Not the Christmas lights I want. It's a possibility, but we just used lights on my card. Okay, I know an easier way. Oh, wait, we don't want to go back to my projects. We're going to lose this. Let's save. And um, I'm going to tell you guys, Somebody asked me why they keep, how can they save their project and just have one project? What they were doing, they're saying, but I, I save as every time. So instead of clicking the word save, which it won't light up unless I move something, clicking the word save, they were clicking save as. So every edit that they saved, 
they had another project. So just so you know, when the there is an asterisk at the name of your um, project, or if it says untitled, you have not saved, so you wanna save it. I don't need to save it because it's only saving the move of this. So we're gonna go to my projects. No, nope, those are Cricut projects. We're gonna go to my projects up here at the top. And this one has some lights in it. So we're gonna go to customize. We're gonna replace this one. We'll go back to it, no worries. Okay, so we have these lights, which I love. So I wanna find out what those lights are called. So I'm gonna click over here. It says Christmas lights. Why couldn't I find those? Um, why is it? Oh, you do not click the name. I don't know why I'm having a brain fart. You just click any of the colors. It pops this open. This says see image information. How many of you have never read that or clicked on it? You could just click this little down arrow. I know most of you who watch my videos weekly know this. And this will take you to the Christmas lights image or you can view the entire cartridge. Let's view the cartridge. Oh yeah, the Christmas in July. I love this cartridge. Love it. Okay, here are the lights. Santa surfing. Oh, that's not what we want. Okay, we got want to go back to my other project. This one. And we're going to click reindeer. We're going to replace the one we just opened because now we just know what to search. And it's on Christmas in July. So let's go here. Insert image. <laughs> Ronald wants Christmas lights, not headlights. Um, let's make these a little smaller. Yay, I'm so glad you guys are learning that you never saw that. Um, okay, let's, I'm going to move you out of the way. I want to cut these. They're too long. Um, let's okay. These are all just one. So I'm going to add a shape, a square. Select those, slice. Now, the only thing that will be sliced is this one layer. See, now they're here. The problem we're going to have is, oh, you know what? Because they were grouped together and I just hid them, they all went away, didn't they? There's no other lights. So here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna go back. We are gonna get Christmas lights. Click insert. I'm gonna size these again so they fit. Let's zoom out. Okay, we're just, that'll work. And we don't need to slice this off. Let's ungroup it. We can contour. Ooh, I don't know how many we need to contour. Let's see. Yep, that'll work. And The red, we're just gonna take one off. That 
works. And the yellow, we're gonna take the two off. Let's bring those down. And the red, we're gonna take one off. It's not red. I really know my colors, guys. I did hair for 25 years and was a color specialist. Okay. There. Now, these probably are not perfect. As I expected, let's... Well, we'll get them perfect later. Right now, let's just group them. Now we can duplicate them. So we have two... Okay, they may be... Oh, we'll just make them a little shorter. There we go. Or we can even send them up this way and we could slice that off and do all that again if you really wanted to i don't want them that way i think that's kind of fun uh let's flip these so they're not exactly the same flip that way and we could slice these off or contour something like that. So if you wanted these in there, could put those like that. Let's flip this. You can do it any way you want. So did you guys learn something today? If you guys are not in my group, Cricut Design Space with Melody Lane, we are about to hit, I haven't checked today, maybe we have, 200,000 members. So we're almost to 200,000 members. When we, we're gonna hit it this weekend, and whenever we do, we're giving away two Easy Press, a small Easy Press and a large Easy Press. The new ones, the Easy Press 2. Let me see where we're at. Um, okay, we are 48 members away. Whoops, hold on. Let me find. 48 members away, we have 199,952 members. So in order, and we have eight waiting. So in order to find it, I also wanna say the project of the day, if you hashtag, make a post and hashtag it with hashtag project of the day, your post will get here at the top of the announcements. So we're gonna click on all announcements to show you how to enter. So this was yesterday's project of the day. And there's some sale ads. All the sale ads are always here at the top. This tells you how to get pro your project featured. And we are giving away a uh, Wisteria Little Cricut. You have two more days to enter this. And to win this, you post a project that says Win Cutie from Melody. And you'll be entered in to win that. And here's just welcome. And there's some rules and information and some more things. And then here is the giveaway for the Easy Press 2. And all you have to do is po read this to make sure I'm not forgetting anything. But uh, there are seven reasons why the Easy Press 2 is better than the Easy Press 1. All you have to do is comment on this post. There are only 9,000 comments. So, oh. There are 9,000 comments, but that's, I mean, there's 200,000 people in the group, or almost. Um, you just have to comment one of these. Which one do you like better? You can answer with a number or you can write it out. So that is how you enter that. 
So who is not in my group? Let me go back to me. Who's not in my group, guys? Are you guys in there? Bye, Sherry. Karen Dudley, welcome. She says this is her first class. Karen, did you learn something? Are you glad you attended or did you know everything that I taught? Or if, did I at least inspire you for something? Carmen says she always learns something new and sometimes just relearn it. I agree. Sometimes I watch a video, I'm like, oh yeah, I forgot about that. Even my own videos, I've... I've had to sometimes rewatch one of my videos. Uh, Denise says, can you just unlock the lights and size that way? You can, but I kind of wanted the lights to be bigger. But if you want smaller lights, you totally could just size them. You can't curve the lights. You can't curve images. You can only curve text. And Jamie just shared a link to the group. She helps me admin that group. She does so much in that group for me. Thank you, Jamie. Oh, and we got a new member. Welcome, Angela. Thank you, Angela. You're going to be excited for the 12 days of Christmas. And there's already, um, when you support my channel, any Patreon or YouTube members or Facebook fan page, you have hundreds and hundreds of files immediately. You get access to them right away. There's no waiting. There's no, um, you, you get all my past files. I've been sharing my files since 2013. Uh, but actually, the Design Space files have been since X Design Space came out in 2014. Do we have any questions? We're supposed to do a spotlight video next, but we're not doing that today because nobody signed up for it today. No one could come today. People, I think, are getting ready for Thanksgiving. And I do have some videos I'm working on editing. I had some videos on Facebook I'm editing to make them a little shorter, and I will try to post those this weekend on YouTube. Uh, what is the link to the wedding group? Let me go find that. It's Cricket Wedding Projects. Here's a link. Welcome, Terry. Thank you for supporting my channel. Look, me and Jamie got the link at the exact same time. Oh, Sharon, thank you so much for chatting and letting me know. I need to move this so it looks like I'm looking at you guys because I'm reading the chat. Welcome, Nancy Fullerman. I'm so glad you guys are looking forward to Saturdays. Uh, do I know of any Maker Black Friday deals? I do know. And um, I'm really not allowed to share. I only know of the deals that are at Cricut.com. Happy holidays to you too, Corey. Happy holidays to everybody. Um, the oil of today, let's do that, because I was thinking that this morning, is abundance. I put this oil on, and I was thinking, when I, when I put it on, I was wishing all of you in my video, because I, I just like throw this on and rub it in, um, abundance throughout the holiday year. 
Like I was like saying that while I put it on before my video, um, that I wish you all have so much abundance throughout the whole year, not just the holiday time through the whole year. I want you guys just to have the most and be the happiest you can absolutely be. Oh, Lynn, thanks for bringing that up. Um, to join my Cricut Design Space with Melody Lane group, it doesn't cost any money. It's absolutely free. Thank you, Joy. Good luck, Tia. Oh, HSN does have a good deal. Um, has a maker bundle. Let me get that for you. I think I can share a link for this. Uh, the maker bundle on HSN will be here. Oh, I lost the chat. Yeah, that link works. You can do five payments for the five flex pay for the maker bundle. It's going to be on air at three o'clock today. If you purchase through that link right there, uh, I will get a small commission if you purchase anything from HSN through that link. Um, I have shared that link on Facebook and I'll share it in the YouTube community. I haven't shared that today. I don't know if I did another day. I don't remember. And for those of you new who just joined my membership, you can go to my page. Let's go over to here and I will show you. So here's my channel and here is where you go, where it says community. So if you click on community, um, scroll down. And like this one says members only. If you're not a member, you will not see these posts that say members only. So um, you'll have to click on read more and the link to this card will be in there. Um, oh, you guys on YouTube have not seen this card, did you? I don't remember where I did it. Let me go get it. Kobe. Okay, hold on. Let me show you this card. Did I do this on Facebook? I think I did it on Facebook. So it's a Z Fold box card. Yeah, this is the one I'm editing to upload to YouTube. Let's do a bun dance. Um, let's go back here. Okay, so there are, there's my doggies. Okay, this is one of the, oh no, that's a hangout. So here are one of the posts. They don't allow enough room to post all of my links in one spot. So I think this one actually just takes you uh, to other files to find the links in the post. So if you're a new member, that's where you go. You go to my community on YouTube. Yeah, isn't this card so cute? I love it. I actually added three more trees. These are a group of trees in Design Space and Access. Thank you, Connie. 
Um, that's really nice. So I duplicated it and added three more trees because I think I can fit more trees. This was the first time putting it together. I could put more on the back and put some more in here. I could even put some back here also. Connie, that's so sweet. Thank you. Oh, Ronald, I'm a little slow. I just got it. Abundance with the oil. Abundance. Okay, I got it. I'm a little slow. That's so funny. Yes, Judy, you should already have it. If you're a $2 Patreon, you already have the file. It's already been posted on Patreon. If you are not getting my emails, you should get an email every time I post. I post a lot. Um, then maybe look in your junk file or look for your Patreon emails. Also, some people with Patreon, they have trouble logging in once in a while. It seems to be better lately. But if you want my files and you don't want to have to go into another website like Patreon, you can get them on the Facebook fan page. Let me show you. Where's my Facebook? Thank you, Joanne. Um, oh, wait. I got to find Facebook. Hold on. Uh, here is my Facebook. Let me find you guys. Hop on over. Okay, so here's, this is, um, you can't see this. Hold on. Let me bring it down. There. It's Melody Lane Designs 815. Uh, that was, 815 was my area code. It's not the date that I lived for. 42 years, 45 years, I don't know. Um, so to become a supporter here, you click become supporter and then you get this little badge next to your name. And then you'll see this over here that says for supporters and that's where all my files go for my supporters. And the YouTube membership is $4.99 and the Facebook is also $4.99. I don't really have control over that. And there's there's only one tier. Patreon has different tiers with different pledge amounts and different perks. You guys have a happy Thanksgiving too, but I will see you before Thanksgiving. I have a lot coming up to share with you guys. I've been really doing a lot and I have so much more I want to do. So I will share that with you, everything uh, that I make. All right, guys, thank you so much. Thank you to my moderators. Thank you for those of you who come back every week. You guys are amazing. I am going to be here next Saturday. I, I will be here every Saturday until the new year unless something happens or I get sick or something and I can't do it. Um, but I don't see that happening. I'm not going anywhere. Staying home. Unless Christmas is on a Saturday. I have no idea what day Christmas is on. Let me look at the calendar. Christmas is not on a Saturday, so we're good. It Christmas is on a Tuesday. How do we do Patreon? Let me give you the link. There is a link in the description of the video too. Uh, so it's patreon.com slash Melody Lane. And for as little as $1, you still get hundreds of files, but you don't get my newest files. So if there's files that you want that I've done in the past last year, whatever, you can get that for a dollar or for $2, you get all of my new design space files. There's hundreds. Thank you, Terry.
Um, Thanksgiving dinner is at a restaurant this year with my mom and dad and a couple of their friends. Nobody wants to cook. I don't want to cook. So I'm just as happy going out and then uh, we'll probably go to my mom's afterwards. She's going to make my special orange salad that I absolutely love so much. Oh, Ronald, running on overtime. Thanks. I'm happy to sit and talk to you guys. Um, she makes this orange salad that has Cool Whip and cottage cheese and oranges and orange jello. It's so yummy. She makes it on the holidays every year. And so she's going to make me. Okay, I love that salad so much. I have asked for that to be my birthday present. That's all she has to do is make me the orange salad, which I can make myself. It's really easy. You dump everything in a bowl and mix it. But it's different with my mom. She makes it better. <laughs> Uh, the maker cannot cut foam board, foam core, like that foam board. It's too thick. Unless you get some that's just a little thinner, it's too thick. It has to be less than 2.44 millimeter. Yes, my mom did like I left some bit emojis around her house. I cut them out on... Uh, Printable vinyl, Cricut printable vinyl, and yeah, she she let, she didn't find them all. I had to give her hints, but she thought they were fun. Um. I will try to post that recipe if I can get it from my mom. It's not a secret recipe. It's good. Like I can, once I get that, like I, I eat it for breakfast every day until it's gone. It's so yummy. Now we told this girl, here's a story. We, this girl I used to work with who did hair, um, we were telling her about it and how we love it. And everyone in our family loves it. It has cottage cheese in it. My brother hates cottage cheese, loves the orange salad with the cottage cheese. And my friend I used to work with, she didn't like cottage cheese. I'm like, well, it just is so good. You don't really taste the cottage cheese. So she thought, okay, she was looking for something new to bring to her family holiday. And so she made this. <laughs> everyone hated it. They spit it out. They hated it so bad. And I'm like, she called me. I'm like, did you make it right? She goes, well, do you want it? Because no one in my house wants it or in her family even wants it. So she brought it over to me and I took it. I said, yeah, I want it. And it tasted great. I loved it. So I don't know. Nobody in her family liked it. Like they did. And to me, it was the best. it's my favorite food. It's so good. Yeah, it's always better when someone else makes it for you, right? Oh, yeah. My mom started adding some pecans to it, too. But she puts those on the side because she doesn't want them to, like, soak it up and get too soggy. Uh, so she started uh, doing it where we could add our own pecans to it. It is mandarin oranges. I know she uses eight cans of oranges, the eight little cans or the bigger cans. For some reason, she likes the little cans. And uh, two things of Cool Whip, one thing of cottage cheese. And if you have a Kroger around you, she gets, she has tried all kinds of cottage cheese. We don't have a Kroger here, but back in Illinois, we had Kroger and it was Kroger brand cottage cheese with the purple writing. That's all I know. <laughs> so is that that made it the best. So it's that cottage cheese, you know, like a container of cottage cheese, regular size, you know? I don't know if it's I don't I don't know what size that is. I think I had that size in the fridge, but it's um so eight little cans of oranges, cottage cheese, 
two things of Cool Whip, you know, the uh, regular Cool Whip. Oh, and I think just one package of orange jello. And you just pour the orange powder, the powder jello, one packet of powder jello in there. And at times she has tried to make it less sugary, so she used, uh, it doesn't taste as good, I'm telling you. <laughs> she used uh, no sugar jello and uh, maybe fat free Cool Whip or no sugar Cool Whip or something. It's so much better with the sugar. Oh, our orange salad has tapioca pudding instead of cottage cheese. Now that is a great alternative, huh? That might be good. I'm gonna have to try that. Um, I think it's large curd, but I'll have to ask my mom. Ooh, crushed pineapple would be good in there too. Um, I would probably, if, if you don't like cottage cheese or you're not sure, I'd maybe use small curd. I'm not quite sure. Small curd might be better. I love pineapple. I actually have some pineapple in my refrigerator right now. It's so yummy. Hi, Patricia. The big tapioca. Okay, guys, are we ready to go? Do we have any last minute questions? Look at let me move the camera so you can see him. He's got his head over the edge. Uh, Jamie says, side note, mix the jello powder with the whip topping first. So with the cool whip, mix that first. Yeah, there's a there's a way that she does it. I'm, I don't remember. Or she mixes it with the cottage cheese first. I don't know. Yeah, if your granddaughter doesn't, okay, how can you not like Cool Whip? I love Cool Whip. But if your daughter doesn't like Cool Whip, don't tell her it's in there. Oh, I love that strawberry pretzel salad too. Cheesecake on a bagel, yummy. Jason, they are working on that. It should be fixed on Monday. Monday afternoon, they're shooting for. Where do we get the cricket emoji? You get that by, um, if you see those cricket emojis right now on the screen, those are badges for the people who support my channel on YouTube. So if you click that join button below, it will show you some perks you get. And you also get these special emojis. I'm just gonna click on each one of them. So you can see, the more members I get, the more emojis I can add. So right now, those are my emojis. Sometimes I change some and take them out and add more when I find a good one. Oh, Debbie, thank you. Debbie said she just joined Patreon and downloaded the Elf Made Me Do It file. I just love that. Oh, yes, drain the oranges. She has to completely drain the oranges. Drains them very, very well. Otherwise, your orange salad will get too liquidy. I have not tried pumpkin fluff. Do 
Karen, when you hit the six month mark, you will have arms on your cricket. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, that's right. Um, that is your next badge. Let me show you the badges. Here they are. So when you first join the YouTube membership, you just have the head. One month you get the antennas, two months you get the body, six months you get the arms. And one year you get the entire thing, two years you turn purple. YouTube makes these uh, new one month, two months, six months. I can't change that. I can't add any more. Um, I did make these, but I can't add more in between these or anything. And it could be just next week because some people have the arms at six months. So some of you may just be one uh, week away. Yeah, the orange jello does need to be dry. Yeah, if somebody's asking about the maker, that is the best machine. There's more coming out for the maker you guys don't know about yet. They're going to continue to add more tools for the maker so it will continually do more and more. Thank you, Debbie Holt. You do not get the emoji head with Patreon? I wish you did. I have no control over that. That is a YouTube thing where YouTube does that. And I, I just don't have any control over that. I would love for Patreon supporters to be able to have a badge or something. Um, but they can't, I mean, I, I have no control over that. Uh, Jamie, orange jello is also super amazing using lemon jello instead of orange. Oh, now, oh. you know what, guys? Let's try. Okay, somebody try this lemon jello with pineapple. No, but yeah, crushed pineapples in the jello. Wouldn't that be good? I don't know if it would be good. Lemon and pineapple. Pineapple and orange and strawberry. Can we just like mix it all together? There is one salad out there like that, something like that, and it has coconut in it. Oh, hi, Glenda. Glenda has arms on hers, I think, but you can hardly see them. Jamie and Glenda do. Yeah, I love the pistachio salad, too. I can hear my dogs drinking. Not my dogs. Look, one's still sleeping. That's Kobe over there drinking. Ooh, pineapple with lime jello. That would be good. To get that emoji, it um, to join my YouTube membership, it costs $4.99 a month. And it, you click that join button underneath my video. That might not be there if you're on an iPad. Um, but it's there if you're on a computer and it says join. And then you click that and it will pop up. Let me see. Oh, wait a minute. I have more. Oh, I didn't click that button. I didn't show all of them. Let's go to design space. I was giving a shout out to the people. I had to click the more button. I had more than I thought. It only showed these. 
So here's a shout out to Tina Gibson, Angela Stone, Kiona Baker, Sandra Jackson, Sheila Rogers, Sharon Foster, Carla Brosnan, and I'll hit you guys up next week too. Linda and Kathy, you guys have all been with me for six months. Uh, I was going to show you this. No, let's go to home. And here's the video we're in right now. And here's the join button. If you don't have the join button, um, Oh, here it is right here. Join YouTube membership. So if you're on the iPad, you can click this link right here um, for the join the YouTube membership. If you click on this, it'll pop up. It will show you the badges you get. It'll show you the emojis and also some other perks that you get. And then you have to click this join button to actually get it. So don't be afraid to click the join button. It doesn't take your money or anything. Um, it lists these. Here comes Kobe. What's he gonna do? What are you doing, Kobe? Yes, Sheila, you have arms. Oh, look. There's Kobe. Not laying in the bed. Okay, guys, I think I'm going to let you go. And thanks for watching. Thanks for hanging out. And I will see you next week. Love you guys. See you in the next video. Bye.